Hello guys, uh, welcome back to my channel, and I'm so excited to make this video um, today because uh, finally uh, season 7 ended for the guild battle. As a result, you guys can see that I finally got my Rachel uh, costume, as well as additional other costumes that came out that are awesome. So, um, I'm going to briefly talk about... Um, the guild battle because uh, the season just ended now is a pre-season 8 so you know uh, whatever you do here is just for like a placement uh, most of the time and so you know it's it's not as important right now but um, this season although you can't see uh, the re um, what is it the reward for the costume is an ace uh, you guys can kind of check it out when you're going through from the pages to pages you might see the ace uh, costume it looks amazing I wish I can take a screenshot but you know it, it stays there for such a short time I can't but you know if you guys do play Korean well make sure you guys check it out and um, as a result uh, I finally got my Rachel skin here it is it looks it looks really good. Um, uh, most of them is red and white uh, themed, um, more like a uniforms uh, for these guys. And Rachel was the last one among the seven knights to get these. And fortunately, my team was able to get a, um, you know, above all those requirements and things like that to uh, get the uh, costume. So I'm really happy and really excited as well as some other awesome costumes for that came out. So here you go. Look at this. Um, so the theme is the um, ice, you know, ice world or glacial world, whatever. So the first one is a Nox. It looks amazing. The icon picture looks amazing as well. Nox just looks great just by itself, but with this costume, it just looks amazing. So, and it's a level four uh, awakened only, but uh, level four. So you know, three hundred. Um, life 60 attack and 30 defense boost so it looks amazing so i'm probably gonna uh, you know buy a set so uh, just in case you know next one i'm i'm trying to make a nox awakening just because of those skins and things like that and here's a rook so um i mean he's a lion ish kind of guy so i don't know what kind of um you know different things you can do but you know you can definitely see that they changed his armor weapons and a shield and things like that and the shield kind of reminds me of like other half part of a nox uh so i don't know if there's any relationship or it's just a it look uh, similar but here is the rook and finally the chancellor chancellor looks just so amazing uh with a a lot of uh, the sword and the shield and um, I mean the armor and things like that. So they're, because their theme is all, you know, the ice world, they're um, all, you know, most of them is like bluish themes. Um, so Chancellor as well as Rook and Nox is one of the awakened characters that are used a lot, uh, especially Chancellor and Rook uh, is used so much. Uh, and like a top higher like you know even zero percent things like that so you know um definitely things to uh, look out for um next is valista valista finally got a skin so you know the more people use the certain characters you know the more most likely the skin's gonna come out and here's the valista it looks amazing as well um she's a white you know like um it reminds me of like a more like a red uh little red riding hood so you know um but this one is not awakened so you can purchase any any one of them if you want and lastly it's a sarah um sarah Felista. most of these guys are not available in um global version but you know uh she's also amazing uh she looks really great so i'm just going to purchase it just because um i love just buying skins uh in general so um i have also purchased the other one as well uh, so, you know, those are the skins that came out, um, they look just amazing, so, you know, if you're, if you have those guys and looking for it, uh, make sure you guys can get it, um, as well as the Rachel skin, so, you know, this is how, um, the, um, uh, some of the things that happen, let's just summon this real quick, okay, so, um, that's happened, and then, um, right now, also, there's, um, higher chance for, um, 
the Wukong and Kyle, one of the four gods, uh, four lords and things like that, as well as, you know, five stars. So I'm going to try to save up my rubies and then try to make another um, the, um, uh, video as well. So, and on 23rd, there's a special, I guess, event where on, you know, one through seven, you get, you know, two times the uh, gold amount, eight dash, you know, it gets 1.5, nine higher chance of getting, um, uh, jewels 10 is the accessory 11 is a weapon blah 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 and then one through seven you have also higher chance of getting a hero as well during these times so you know it's like um uh, something you know just um look out for if you're short on money you know go or short on you know certain, certain like a jewels and things like that you guys can go on this time and then um uh, go through the dungeons and then uh, get those uh special uh, like a bonus and uh, a ne next thing is that you can get also uh, so see a random Christmas mimic I've seen like one or two and in there there's a Christmas uh, items which are mostly the um, the ones that you can look out for on the dictionary as well and also the um, uh, let's see the one that you can plus the jewel as well as Fina so you know uh, Fina's just awesome, so, uh, I hope I get Fina, though, uh, you can get only one per account, with, um, to limit, but, uh, hopefully I get the Fina, so I can, uh, transcend other guys, so, that's the update that was, um, up, and today, I'm going to just, um, do the hell mode for a daily dungeons in a Korean version, uh, right now in global version, uh, there's only two, and it's fairly easy, so, that's why I'm doing a um, the hell mode here uh, because I also know that you know a lot of people um, play the Korean version as well and then they want some advice so um, what I recommend is if you guys have enough uh, guys to uh, farm really well I recommend to get a Lee as your first awakened character uh, besides other ones just because uh, Lee is essential in a lot of the hell mode um dungeons uh the dailies so that's why the reason why you know i suggest it as well as you know it's really helpful when you go up a tower and things like that as well so um compared to the other ones where you can um uh win a lot in a what is it the arena and things like that um you know it's it's just clearly a lot better so i'm just going to play um you guys can see how it goes. Um, Spike, Ali, um, Fung Yuan, Delens, Pascal. Um, it's not out in global version, but just by Li, he can carry throughout the whole thing. So, and one tip uh, is that even if you guys lose, um, you guys can still um, what is it? Um, even if you lose, you guys can still try on uh, uh as many as you want until you win. Uh, most likely if you lose you can try the lower um, lower one uh, or something like that so you guys can get the reward so it's just the um, you guys can see that the level is 70 you know so it's a lot stronger a lot tankier as well as you know um, they're just they just just they do just massive damage so you know a lot of times you put the guys that have a hit immunity uh, most of time so for instance like a Delans you see um, Fung Yen also uh, has you know the hit immunity as well uh, so I just use Delans as skill to silence them so you know it prevents them from further using the skills uh, if it works but let's see try to use a spike so if maybe I can freeze them so most of the time though um uh because they're so much stronger uh most of you guys uh, will die at you know most uh one or two hits even my you know spike that just dies right away so you know it shows how strong they are so uh that's why you need the hit immunity guys to just hold it off and um stall until their uh you know the skill and those things are gone so I'm just going to uh, reset the Pascal's effect and these usually take I mean depends on your team 
it usually takes a little bit longer maybe like five to between five to ten minutes depends on how good your team is so let me see I try to do as fast as I can but you know um, it's just very annoying I think I can just hold it off and then the turn will pass by faster if you do that and then it'll just die uh, those people who comes back after their death um, is so much you know so annoying but uh, there's nothing you can do about it unless you take some other guys uh, like Shogyo or things like that but it takes um, they're so weak so that's why I don't really take them so um, it's basically same thing you know because you your guys don't take a hit and their guys you know do take a hit you try to burst them out before they do anything and you guys can see that uh, except Lee everyone else is silenced in their team so um, you guys can just constantly deal damage um, let's see in this map uh, most likely I think I hope I can try uh, I, sh I wish I tried but you can just put a Lee and some random guys and you guys should be still be able to kill this um uh, the this daily at least the one for the magic material the uh, water one just because this one is probably one of the easiest one so um, each day I'm going to try to uh, make a video about a the dailies because this is one of the um, like a hot uh, topic for many people who um, trying to get uh, more uh, destruction of fragments you know the main reason why also you do this besides getting the element is because you can get the uh, fragment of destruction you know which helps you a lot uh, with awakening you know because that's the only source where you can get it besides the uh, the other uh, stuff like event or purchasing through the topaz and things like that and Lee helps a lot. The reason is because he has a hit immunity for three turns, as well as he's um, the bottom skill, the first skill. What it does is uh, it makes the highest HP um, care, uh, the enemy uh, make into life one. You know, so even the tankiest guy can just be uh, make it into a life one, and then you can just easily kill it off. So, like you guys see. It just turns into life one, and then any guys can hit it, and basically that that guy will die. Um, let me just use the Delans as silence, so hopefully they can't use as much skills. So yeah, Delans the silence just helps um, if you do have them. If you don't, then it's it's still okay. Um, it's not like Delans is absolutely needed needed in here, but. Um, Delans right now is used a lot in a lot of different content. Um, almost every the daily though for um, just to be um, um, easier, just because the silence is so good. So like you guys see, uh, a lot of my guys die, but it, it doesn't really matter because these guys don't get hit. Yeah, uh, you know, for any kind of damage for three turns, and then that just helps a lot. So now. I'll use the Lee skill again. Um, Lee's awakening skill, if you guys don't know, creates a you know self um, the copy of himself that is you know exactly same as the the other Lee. So see like you guys see just saw um, it just dies right off, and then I'll just wait until my Lee's uh, you know the first skill uh, goes again because also it uh, reduces any kind of turn buff by three turns. So the Peng Yong will just die right away instead of I can wait also, but um, I just want to make this as quick as possible so so now we're done and then it's about yeah six minutes so I think I could have done maybe faster as well but you know this is how you do it um, for the hell mode for this is a what Wednesday I think so you get 15 fragments as well as a four star so you don't have to wait uh, you know two weeks to make this into the um, to get two three stars and make it into four so and you know having a lot of um higher um the elements will just help you a lot in a lot of different content so uh that was my video about the uh, daily um dungeon so i'm i'll be back with uh, another videos i hope you guys enjoy it and then make sure you guys check out the facebook page um i've already received some feedback as well as messages um i tried to get to you back as soon as possible and um i hope you guys like my video and then 
Um, I'll see you guys next time. Thank you.